Hello everybody, Chris Profi, Musically Obsessed. So I just posted a video celebrating the 35th anniversary of Stripers and God We Trust. So I figured I would follow it with a short video about my Striper vinyl collection. I don't have everything. Uh, as I've said in other videos when I've shown collections of mine, I've pretty much got everything of Stripers on CD, but I'm slowly building uh, the vinyl collection. Saw Striper live at a uh, little club near my house called The Chance in Poughkeepsie, New York. Put on a phenomenal show. Uh, everything was true from stories that I heard about them throwing little Bibles out to the audience. I still have my Bible. I have to find it, but it's got a little sticker on there that says Striper. Uh, the, the band put on a phenomenal show. Uh, Michael Sweet can still sing. He can still sing today. Striper is still releasing albums. They've gotten heavier. They've probably even gotten better with every album. So let me show you what I've got. Um, a few years back, Striper released uh, an album called The Rock Regime Demos. And basically, Striper was known as Rock Regime before they changed their name to Striper. And these were their early recordings back from 1983. And uh, this is a limited edition release. And I think that this was on colored wax. Yes, it was. All right, so this is on this sort of greenish blue wax. Uh, cool to have that as a Striper fan. I've also got their second album, Soldiers Under Command. And there they are looking tough in front of their Striper mobile. All right, this is a cool release. I was looking at this before. Um, this included the lyric sheet. It also includes a order form. Let me show you this. And it looks like you could have ordered um, some bandanas and a no devil button, a 777 button, uh, t-shirts, poster. So there was the order form. It's always fun to find those in these early recordings. And this version happens to be on white vinyl, which I thought was interesting. Um, I also have their breakthrough album, their third record, To Hell With The Devil. This is the uncensored cover. Of course, this was released, uh, you know, with just pretty much a black cover with just this logo on it. I'll probably pick that up at some point. But I've always loved the illustration on the censored cover, or the uncensored cover. You know, and thinking about things nowadays, you know, you wonder why this was even, uh, you know, censored and denied. I don't see anything wrong with it. This album, I mean, so many hits. To Hell With The Devil, Calling On You, Free, Honestly, um... I think All of Me might have been a minor hit as well. But, you know, they matched those ballads and softer songs with an intensity and heavy metal vibe. This is a gatefold. And this also... Does this have anything inside? No, my copy doesn't have anything on, on the inside. But I love this um, white Enigma label. All right, and then I have the uh, follow-up. I'm not gonna open this one up because I basically showed the contents in my last video. So I'll link the video for my In God We Trust album below. So check that out. But this was the album that followed To Hell With The Devil. Equally as good. Striper was definitely on a roll. I need to get the album that followed this, Against The Law. That's a hard one to find, but that album is great. They do a version of Shining Star. And then uh, Striper sort of took, uh, they were not active between like 1990 and 2005, but they have uh, come back with a vengeance since 2005. I think they've made like nine albums and they're all good. This is their 2020 release, Even the Devil Believes. And this is a gatefold. And 
and uh, any goodies in here. Uh, it doesn't look like there's any goodies, but the album is on Frontier Records, and it's got a custom label, which is pretty cool. So there you go. That is my Striper vinyl collection. I do want to pick up uh, the Yellow and Black Attack. I want to get Against the Law as well, and I want to get some of their uh, later albums on vinyl as well. Again, I have them all on CD, but I think today is going to be a Striper day for me. Let's celebrate Striper. All right, everyone.